वेलकम बैक सो गाइस इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिलीट द इमेज फ्रॉम द डेटाबेस एंड अनलिंक और डिलीट द इमेज फ्रॉम योर अपलोडेड फोल्डर ओके सो गाइस विल गो टू आर एडमिन पैनल वेयर वी आर स्टोरिंग दिस इमेज एडिटिंग एंड अपडेटिंग इट एंड देन यू आर क्लिकिंग टू डिलीट सो वेन यू आर डिलीटिंग एक्सक्यूज मी वेन यू आर डिलीटिंग the time your row is getting deleted but your image is not getting deleted right that is which is in your folder so like when you are uploading into folder oops one second here guys so when you delete that it should get deleted mean to say this service category image is there computer lab image so this image should be get deleted when you delete the data from your folder also okay so guys let's start with the coding part for it so let's get back to our chrome and vs code so guys we are on the faculty page over here so once we are going to table so this is my table where i am fetching all this data so this is my delete let me close this okay so this is my delete button faculty delete button so when i click this i am going to code.php file so let me go to code.php file so this is my file and let's give control f and search so i'm searching it's over here so guys this is my code to delete the data which we have learnt in previous video So guys now I want to set a condition over here while deleting it I want to delete that image also from this folder okay so for that we will set now so guys first step we have to write a query called uh, checking the data so we'll create a variable called query is equal to and inside that we'll write a statement select star from your table name that is faculty so copy put a condition where and give your id into single quotes your id okay so we are deleting the data by id so we are co just copying this id and pasting over here done so now let's execute this statement so let's type query run okay query run is equal to we can run this query by using mysql like query method or function in php okay so let's type first the connections come database connection and then your query right so guys um okay we have used the query already over here so we need to change that it will otherwise it will clash the okay we can tell check check query check run query and again with this where you have included that check run check query okay so when it will search that image that time we want to take the data so you can take from for each loop or while loop so i'll just use for each loop in this and uh, get the data so you can copy this variable copy copy this variable and as you can give your name any defined name so let's type as a row or uh, give your custom name rows just copy this and bring the data of what the image so my column image name is faculty let's go to database it's called images images <coughs> so images over here and we want to just check once the image is coming correct or not so let me echo this and let me comment this once and let's see so the image is coming correct one or not let's go back and reload the page so let me delete on the id 7 delete service category dot png the name is showing let's go to database id number 7 service category dot png it's showing clearly okay guys so now the 
perfect image has come i mean image name has come so let's get back and back to our code then you are going to find the path of it so for that we will give a if condition so like that will be if open bracket close bracket and again else do this hit create a variable called image path is equal to your folder name where you are going to upload and give a forward slash and then concatenate the this echoing path one right so you are just going to cut this and remove everything and paste it at the last so paste over here so my folder where i'm uploading is that these images are inside admin folder upload okay upload i am going to type of the because i am already in this code.php is already in admin so we have to type upload over here so let me type upload okay so we are getting the path so when this is executing it i want to delete and then delete the image so you can call this the code right which we have commented right now so guys let us cut this and paste inside this set it that's it and we don't need this else condition right now because obviously the image will be there so we have to unlink that so when you are going to delete that take that image and then when this query successfully runs it after deleting that time we are going to call this image path and type in the success code called unlink function unlink function and then set unlink so that will delete the image so guys now the code is set let me just show you very clear okay yes guys so this is the code for it now to check and delete the image from your folder so guys let's get back and test it reloaded and there is id number 7 and this is the service category image that is in your database over here i mean folder then let's delete this so let me click on delete so perfectly faculty data deleted let's search below four five and eight nine it is so seven is not there from database also it's get deleted okay so let us let it reload okay seven id is deleted full data and let us go and check into our folder see ya guys so there is no image for that also so guys we have completed that how to delete the image from the folder in php so guys thank you for watching this video please subscribe like and share